Hi, I'm Chris. Welcome to the Round Corner Brigade. We're situated underneath the Hills District uh, Control Centre and we've got a number of tankers in this brigade, including a 9, a 7 and a 1. But we've also got two bulk water tankers, which is what I want to talk about today. Right, the first truck we're going to talk about today is Round Corner Bulk. Now it requires a heavy rigid licence to drive. It's a bogey rear drive with the front axis steer only. The truck carries 13,000 litres of water, which is roughly speaking four Cat 1s. Runs a standard uh, Cat 1 pump, mid mount for weight distribution and the, the normal fittings and foam distributor like you'd have on a, a Cat 1. Round Corner Bulk um, looks like a new truck, but it's actually 15 years old. Last year it got a stripes and LED lights upgrade, but so it can last for a, another 10 years. Right, the pump controls are similar to a standard Cat 1 with the outlets and, and inlets. However, it's also got electronic over air operated valves for the main water supply from the tank. So it means you can operate from either inside the cabin, from the side of the truck, or from the rear. We've also got stand pipes, a portable pump that's actually a, a volume pump. It's because this truck is, uh, requires to be filling from dams uh, as well as uh, from hydrant. It carries suction hose just like a Cat 1. There's three on this side and three on the other giving you plenty of, of suction hose to go even at, at dams. On the driver's side of the truck we've got the, the foam drums, uh, the fittings and hose and also a generator which is hardwired into the truck so for extended periods you don't have to run the engine you can run all the lights off the generator. Right, the bulk has a crew of two in the cabin. It's an automatic transmission, has a number of radios, uh, your GRN radio, your fire ground radio. Uh, we also have two handheld fire ground, a handheld GRN, and also a Bluetooth GRN. Now the reason we've got so many options here is because we often go to large incidents outside of the district or even a large fire inside the Shire, in which case we might be monitoring a number of channels simultaneously either from within the cabin or outside, so we want all the options possible. As well as that, we have um, a bit different from a normal Cat 1 or the new, new builds, even though we've got the controls to start the pump and run the, the idle speed as a, a modern Cat 1 does, we also can see the water levels in the tank with the LED displays. Also, something slightly different, uh, we've got a, a roof mounted monitor on this truck, which is operated from a joystick from within the cabin. A bit different from uh, modern Cat 1s with the, uh, the bumper mounted uh, monitor. The beauty of the roof monitor is that it can go 90 degrees from the truck, which is great on trails. While round corner bolt can work independently, it's best actually used in conjunction with our other bolt tanker, round corner 5. So at a uh, structure fire where we have um, low water pressure or no water at all from town water, we'll send the bulk in to be the, the truck directly behind the attack tankers and then the five will then be filling the, the, the bulk tanker to keep the water supply up and make sure we're able to maintain water to those uh, attack lines. Round Corner 5 is a 35 year old tanker, uh, it was first purchased uh, in 1986, brand new for the district. It um, also works independently, but it can, again, it works great together with the um, Round Corner Bulk in situations in bushfire, uh, out in the fire ground, where the bulk tanker will go down as far down a, a dirt road or a firm paddock as it can, and then it'll be Round Corner 5 which then goes down from the bulk down and fills up the tankers in the field. Round Corner 5 is fully four-wheel drive capable and actually can go anywhere a Cat 1 can go. Inside the cabin it, it sits a crew of three, uh, although it can operate easily with a crew of two. It's a manual transmission, uh, the transfer case is air engaged, so it's quite simple to use. Uh, the radios are very similar to the bulk, it's got a GRN radio, a fire ground radio hardwired, plus it's got two handheld fire grounds and a handheld GRN. One of the reasons we've kept Round Corner 5 for so long is that it's a, a truly a multi-purpose platform that's not available on the current builds. It's got a live reel, it's got a drip torch, it's got a chainsaw, um, normal hoses and fittings a Cat 1 would have, uh, plus normal hand tools. On the rear tray of the Cat 5, we've got a portable pump. We've also got a twin manual uh, monitor mount on both the driver's side and the passenger side. You have to have a crewman on the back here operating it and then you can still use a 38 uh, branch basically off the back of the truck. Similar to Round Corner Bulk, Round Corner 5 has a mid-mounted pump uh, for weight distribution. 
It's, it's basically a Cat 1 wet end, although it's a slightly different uh, pump arrangement. The tank is 6,500 litres, which is roughly speaking two Cat 1s. So paired together with the bulk and, and the 5, that's a good combination.